Pronto right there. Shit, I didn't know it was this fat. What's up boys, it's Sonic at New England Motors. My first vlog video. Me trying to drop a few videos every week for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy the content that we make. Let's get into it. So I recently bought this car from Florida, AG Hatch, K20Z3 swap. Came with a set of ITBs, fiberglass hood. We changed all that stuff over yesterday. Jordan put a RBC manifold, stock auto body. Now it needs a tune. Jamie should be here around three o'clock, get this car tuned and put it on the dyno. Probably make like 215, 220, stock motor, stock internals. Put in the comments what you guys think it's gonna make for power. I'm gonna ask all the guys what they think it's gonna make. Get some dollar bets on it. Maybe take Jordan's money today. Yeah, J Rock. How much power do you think the hatch is gonna make? The one, the one you worked, the one you worked on yesterday. Yeah, Jamie's gonna be here at 2:30, 3 o'clock. I didn't hold on. Hold on. I didn't even get paid for the last one. Who won that one? <laughs> this thing didn't even get paid when the egg smashes. <laughs> 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 oh, dirty. What is that? Is it it's a K20 Z3. It I'll tell you what it made before. It made 233 with the ITBs. So all we changed now was the ITBs and the throttle body. And the car came from Florida. And it's on pump gas. I guess before I recorded this, I guess 215. So and I, I I'm gonna take both of you guys' money today. I'll say two <laughs> So on our way to storage. I'm about to put Jordan's carbon fiber trunk on. I don't think he's seen this car in like six months. That shit's gotta be dusty. It's probably gonna be sitting there for the next six months. Six years, <laughs> bitch. Get it right. <laughs> but we're gonna put his carbon fiber trunk on. It's been sitting in the shop for like a couple months now. Uh, show you guys this car. He got a green EG hatch. He just bought. A lot of you guys might know he got rid of his gray hatch last year. Probably regrets that biggest regret. A lot of people like, actually don't think I got rid of it. So many people ask me when I'm bringing it back out. It's like, bro. A lot of people don't really pay attention. Like this one dude asked me on social media, like, oh, you changed your B series to a K series, and now you made your K series all wheel drive. They don't know have four different hatchbacks. That's the problem with you though. Is nobody? I can't even keep up with you, and I fucking. I work with you every day. Like, <laughs> I don't even know what car is what anymore. Man. I really, really thought about selling three and just keeping one, but it's like, it's tough because when you have all four cars, like you want the best of everything: B series turbo, KO wheel drive, whether it's a street car, front wheel drive. Options are always good too to have. What's and your that, favorite? What's your favorite car out of the I'll four? I'll tell you right now, my least favorite. I already know what you're gonna say. <laughs> you're gonna say it's my street car. He hated that car since he put the five lug on the car. Yeah, Cause the five lug gave him a bunch of problems. I got some personal issues with that fucking car. But that car honestly is what, out of all four of my cars, that one's like my favorite looking car. It's fucking, it's mad clean. Whoever painted that car, that's the only car that you have that wasn't painted. And you. that car is, got painted in a garage. Like it didn't even get painted at the shop. That's crazy. And that's the cleanest car that I own. But yeah, couple, we'll be at the storage in a couple minutes. I'll give you a quick uh, walk around in Jordan's car and when he installs his hatch. So we just got to the storage. Jordan's hatch is right there. Gotta put the trunk on. We don't got no lights in here. Might be a little bit dark. This car's super dope. Good, good base to start off with. Yeah, you like the green? It grew on me. It grew? I, I really... I originally hated this color so much because when I was younger, I built my first hatchback and it got stolen. And ever since then, I never, I never want another green one ever in my life. Honestly, like the green looks good. Like if I had to pick between, I, I wouldn't be able to choose. Both cars look good in my opinion. After this car is all done, you're gonna, I think you're gonna really gonna like it. I feel like the gray one is gonna look better, but this one I'm gonna have more fun with. So his plans with this car, he's planning to run this car in the M1 class. Uh, you know, obviously legal. Make car, put the car to weight. Um, probably we need to do ninety nine. Yeah. Ninety nine on M one. Uh, he's gonna race in like I said, M one class. Hopefully, uh, summer of twenty twenty two. Twenty thirty. Twenty thirty. You got some twenty sixes. You might be. Uh, you might be going to the outlaw class. <laughs> okay. So we lock the key. Well, we don't have the keys with us for this car. The car has an X bar and only the trunk's open. So here, hold yeah. this for me, bro. Can we do a side bet on who's gonna fit through here? I don't know. I should bought this side. Mm -hmm. 
I'm not 16 no more. This is about to be fucking tight. <laughs> I put it on head first. Yeah? Hell yeah. Uh, I'll bet you twenty dollars you're not getting in. I'll bet you twenty dollars that I'm getting in. I'm trying to make I bet you forty 20, bucks. I'll get in. Until right there. Shit! I didn't know it was this fat. It's definitely like gut. It's not dick. That's <laughs> holding him back. <laughs> <laughs> if this seat would have went down, I... damn bro, I'm not big. Twenty. <sighs> I'm getting a 20. No, I don't know you, bro. <laughs> Hold on. God, God, I need a fucking... <laughs> I hope this video gets posted so people can actually see what the fuck we do and go through. <laughs> I want my 20. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Can I get my $20? Yeah, um, let me see. I got... I gotta figure out what I get paid out for the last dino video that I didn't get paid for, <laughs> so I'm probably really only out like $9. Hey, Jay, yeah. after you, bro. I'm here to I'm here to claim my twenty bucks. I'll buy you a hat. <laughs> Can I cash in? Yeah, I I'm here to cash in, bro. You're gonna actually let me pay? Uh, yeah, today. Yeah. Because usually you're a bitch and you don't let me pay. <laughs> I'm cashing in my money today. If I don't get it today, I'm never gonna get it. Yo, free food ain't never tastes so good. I bet you after you eat this, you definitely ain't fitting. I want a rematch. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy my $20 meal from J-Rock. Transporter just shows up with my three cars I just bought from Florida. I bought a K-Series EM1, a Project EM1, and a all original GSR. All right, so this red SI has a K-Swap in it. It needs to be finished. Uh, that car is already all done, ready to go. It's got a K-Swap in it also. And a Sonic Blue GSR Integra. All stock. It just has a few mods done to it, like, you know, intake header exhaust. I'm gonna put all the stock parts back on. Now we gotta unload all three cars. It's gonna be fun because the bottom one doesn't run, so it's super cold out, it's like 30 degrees. Jordan's gonna be motherfucking right now. Yo, J-Rock. Yeah. You ate your Wheaties last night? Mm -hmm. You ate your Wheaties? No. You know one of these cars don't run, right? <laughs> I think you have the wrong address. Got the GSR unloaded. Two more to go. We got the EG on the rollers. I'm gonna strap it up, wait for Jamie to come. And Jordan guessed 214, I guess 215. I wish you guys could have saw this car after. Uh, this car came on uh, both gram lights. And uh, like I said, I had a fiberglass with white hood. Put a brand new Saibon carbon hood on it. The car looks amazing with these blue wheels. I'm also gonna put red Recaros in here that I have for it to set it off because the red um, seats with the wheels, it's gonna look great. So we've got about an hour until Jamie gets here and then we'll get on the roller, see what it makes. Yo, J-Rock, yeah. you know I'm gonna take your money today, right? I already took your money once. I took 20 bucks from you earlier. Free lunch. Only, only money, bro. Free uh, what, what, what did you guess? Huh? What did you guess? For, oh, you guessed 210. Yeah. Oh, we definitely taking your money. 210. This ain't no B series. It looks like you guess like 150. 150? Oh, I think I pulled, <laughs> pulled, pulled the injector plug out. Got the cars unloaded. This car looks great. 2000 EM1 with a K swap. Came from Florida. Then we have. Obviously the EG on the dyno also came from Florida. Then the EM1 project. Needs a lot of work. Swap needs to get pulled, whole front end out. Needs a lot, a lot of work. Uh, you can see it's been sitting for a while. No interior. Pretty much needs to be fully rebuilt. So you guys will get to see the process of this car come to life. So take it day by day and I'll show you guys the process of this car. This car is pretty much ready to go. Just a few touch-ups and it's pretty much done. And then the GSR, also unloaded. Needs a little bit of, a little bit of work, but not too crazy. Uh, I'm gonna put the full stock exhaust back on. Some, uh, missing a few emblems. And uh, thinking about getting an Integra Type R front lip. 
and that's pretty much it. This car is uh, it's got I think 120,000 miles, so not too bad. But I'll start working on them after I finish the cars that we have here. Uh, this Integra Type R is my personal car. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but just gonna finish it, finish detailing it, and then put it back in my garage for now. I can't wait for you guys to see the process on the red SI because uh, that car is pretty hurt right now. But well, obviously, it'll come back to life. So, yo, J Rock, uh, I need another prediction. Of what? S2000. I made my prediction already. I don't even know anything about that car. I'll tell you, I'll give you a quick uh, rundown stock motor, E85, uh, precision 6262. And that's that's pretty much all you need to know. How many pounds of boost? Stock motor. <laughs> so uh, I don't know. You gotta ask Jamie that question. Forty. Four eighty. Yeah. All right. It's a pretty good guess. Four eighty. Four eighty two two fourteen. What do you guys on I'm gonna go five hundred. I said 550, but I think Jamie's going to leave it. Stock motor is right around 5, but I'm going to say on the safe end, 480. Okay, I said 5. I think they do a little bit over 5 because on E85. Oh, it's on? Oh, I thought it was fun. No, I said it's E85. Right. I'll All right. I'll steal it. So you're at 480 and 214. 214? Yeah. It's a good guess. I'm still going. I'm going to take your money somehow. I know one bet that I would win. What? If I tune this, that shit would blow up. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what do you think about the new project over there? Which you're hesitant, you're, you're like, hesitant to look over there right now. We got like 12. Where's your sunglasses? Oh, uh, sunglasses? <laughs> <laughs> this, this one? You know what the best part is? Come on, let me show you. The best part about this car is... Let me look at the car. Right here. Oh, that came with the car. That was that special, right? Yeah. You got to hang that up. We in already your... tore that half up. <laughs> we already fucked that shit up. You got to hang that up in your bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you excited? Because I'm not. About what? About this. Nah, I didn't even find it yet. Like, <laughs> and this is the shit. Like, then a whole swap has to come out. This is pretty bad. The suspension looks a little messed up. This is probably the worst car I've ever seen you buy. The end result, I think, is going to be real, real nice. Well, that's because it's here. Like, everything that comes out of here is nice, but the shit... How it comes in is really bad. Is like, by the time you guys see this video, this car is going to look better than this car. This car looks really good. It does. This is a really nice car. Alright. But when we're done with that, I bet lunch on it. No, I ain't betting. <laughs> so I'm going to give you guys a full detailed video of how bad this car actually is. It's definitely savable. It's not too, too bad, like where it can't come back. But just to show you guys the type of work that we do, uh, like how bad this is and how good it's gonna look after all. Yeah, JR, you gonna be ready for this journey? Yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna be ready. So the radiator support obviously has to come out. We're gonna put a brand new radiator support. Whole engine bay is gonna get painted. The swap has to come back out. Uh, obviously get cleaned up. Just showing you guys the current state of how bad it is. This car is like super, super messy. It's like really, really bad. Uh, we're gonna change the whole front end out, new radiator support, new hood. I'm gonna clean up the complete swap. The interior is really rough, but we're gonna get to that after we finish the engine bay. Do you guys think this car is savable? It's really, really rough. Like one of the roughest cars that we got in, but it has potential. <laughs> I think you think it's savable. <laughs> I, don't know, I guess I guess I'm gonna have to subscribe and see because this shit is raw. It needs a new door panel, carpet, a whole bunch of work in there, but it has potential. The paint is re definitely rough, so it's gonna come back to life. It's just need to get this sorted out and then go from there. <laughs> you got WD-40. The trunk was bad. Like all the parts for this car to get running are in the trunk, but a lot of it is going in the trash. So, hey, you ready to sort through that? Yo, Kevin! I guess it's transport day here in New England. Got another truck here. Yo, Kev, yeah. what do you think's in the truck? A bucket? Probably a bucket. Yeah, that's what I thought. Probably another bucket. 
another car came from Florida. I'll show you guys when it unloads. See what it looks like. Hopefully it's not a bucket. Yeah, J Rock, do we buy a bucket? I don't know. It's, it's, on, it's too high up in the air to tell right now, but <laughs> the streak that you're on right now, bro. I'm pretty good though. I think I'm two for two. Two buckets, two straight cars. Is it, is it a bucket? Huh? How's the car looking? Looking good? Yeah. So you bought two solid cars today, but then the one turd that came in, bro, probably made up for both of those. So it's like two buckets. Cause that shit's rough. Two for two. What else you got in there? Check it out. Got some glasses. That's what I'm talking about. I got classic up there. Yeah, you bought these, bro? You bought dishes? Damn. Nah, no, I ain't buy that. I don't got, no, I don't got enough money for that. <laughs> what else you got up there? That's an EP3 or a Fit. That's a Fit. <laughs> yeah, glass is way too dark. <laughs> we got, we bought a DA Integra. I'll show you guys what it looks like in a minute. Car unloaded. What you guys see the swap? Yo, Kev, what kind of swap you think I got? K20. K20 and a DA. I charged the battery. This car got airbags, so I'm so high. I'm gonna be honest, you did a good job with this car. You like it? Yeah, it's pretty good. It's not bad, right? Needs a little bit of touch up, but. Yeah, you gotta pop that hood. Well, I'm gonna let Kev, I'm gonna let Kev uh, open the hood. Is this a sign of what we're getting into? Look at his face, huh? You like that, huh? Baby. Oh, baby. You like that, huh? Where's this car from, Cali? Nah, it's from uh, Florida. I'll say he did a good job with this. You think this is on the bucket list or not? Yeah. You like this car? This one too. Yes. I took a picture. Willowwood brakes. Is that uh, three for two? This one needs, it's, the body's really good in it. It just needs the wheels, the suspension needs some, some tweaking. A little bit of touch up paint nice here and there. Yo, Kev, you can take next lane. I don't want the problems. <laughs> Yo, J-Rock, flip those switches, baby. You probably got to build pressure. <laughs> build pressure. Release the pressure. Okay. <laughs> okay. You go in the front? Yeah, that shit's on the floor. Yeah, you look good in there, bro. That shit's tucking tires. This is Jared back in 06. Am I three wheeling? Yeah, you three wheeling right now. You think he in Cali or something? This shit looks crazy. <laughs> yeah, it shit looks so funny like that. <laughs> J-Rock is a trip. <laughs> Yo, he let the air out. He'll <laughs> be a tucking tire. <laughs> Got my son inside my car. Yo, what are the what are, what are the predictions? Two fourteen, baby. Let's go. Okay. Jamie said two Jamie said two seventeen. Everybody lost. Yeah, That's right. I just took my dollar for gas. Everybody lost. 
first first number 224 on a Z3. Beginner's luck, yo. How the fuck is the glass guy gonna come Honestly, in here? Honestly, he, you know who was gonna win? He was gonna win like always. Jamie was gonna win. He's gonna have the highest horsepower number. 224 from a Z3 is like unheard of. We're putting in a quarter glass uh, moldings right now, but we're also tuning while we're doing that. So I got OEM on the moldings, gonna put them on. But 2 224 first pull. Uh, I'll show you guys the next pull. Single, bro. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. You, you, you won. You got. We gotta give you the money. You got the best bet. You put me down at 218, but I said 212. Oh, did you? Mm -hmm. oh, I didn't know. I guess Jamie took our money. Took all six dollars. So. Yo, Jamie, you probably took a hundred dollars from us in the past like year. <laughs> probably. Here's six, uh, seven bucks. Out of seven bucks. bucks. Had the highest bet, 217. He made 225. I would I would really think that from a type S. Final numbers on the hatch, 225. Yo, why Honda do us like that, bro? They did us dirty, bro. So now we don't got no molding because they sent us the wrong stuff. I don't know what they sent us. So now the car's gonna have to sit here with no, uh, no windows in the back. But at least it's tuned, ready to go. I'm gonna order the moldings tonight. Hopefully we get them in a couple days. Hey, he's the best guys in the business right here. That's right, ski brother. So we got the S two thousand on the rollers now. <laughs> so I lied to Jordan. I told Jordan this shit was on E eighty five, but this shit's on pump gas. <laughs> so the what's car. That, what size is the turbo on this? Sixty two, sixty two. Oil cool. Uh, AM V two. Yo, Jamie, what's, what's he get for final numbers? 400. On E85, what do you think it would have made? Uh, made like uh, uh, Jordan guessed 480. So. Jamie right on the money again, said 400 horsepower. Can never bet with him. But 400 horsepower, can't complain. You're lucky your car ain't here though. Yeah, I would have right. busted that ass. I would definitely bust it ass. <laughs> 403. The tune that was originally in here was garbage. It's all set now, ready to go. Final numbers on the S2000, 403. Uh, big thanks to Jamie. Comes through all the time. Can't thank him enough. We're almost done with the hatchback. Got to put two uh, quarter glass moldings and then we're all set with the hatch. S2000 is ready to roll. It's been a long day here at New England Motors. I appreciate you guys watching. Please like, subscribe. See you guys later.